Hey guys, I'm going to be doing another collectibles video, and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys a Hanamex 666S. It's apparently a clone off of one of Radio Shack's products from 1977. That's when this came out, I think. I couldn't find too much about this on the internet, so whatever I read in the manual is basically all I know about this. So, I'm pretty sure it plugs into your TV, but modern TVs won't support this. Um, so, you're going to have to find an old TV to be able to play this or buy some kind of conversion thing, conversion so that this will work. So, this has never been played. It's still in the styrofoam. I'm just going to open it up and show you guys the inside, I guess. So, let's open it. You get the manual. And the warranty. So that if it breaks, it says in here that if it breaks, you can send them $5 and this, and they'll send you a brand new one. So I guess that's the warranty they have. Um, they're, I guess it says it's made in Hong Kong, so I don't know. Just. So, here you've got the Hanamex, like I said, it's never been played, it's still wrapped. you basically got one knob here, a serve button, and then there's also a smaller control for the second player, as you see in the box, which would be right here. So, two people can play off this one thing. There's only four games on here, all the games are basically the same. It's tennis, American soccer, or you want to call it football or whatever if you're in England. Um, squash and practice handball. Like I said, they're all just variations of Pong, so don't expect too much if you get one of these in game-wise because it's basically just Pong. Um, it's got some different speeds that you can play at and different, like, the, I guess you want to call it the bat that you hit the ball with. You can change the size of it on here. Um, the speed. So yeah, that's basically it the Hanamex 666S, and the 666 is just the model number, it's not devil references or anything, as you can see. I don't know if you can see, but yeah, so my uncle sent this to me a couple months ago, and it's one of my cool little collection items I have from the 70s, way before I was born, so there you guys go, the Hanamex 666. Thanks for watching, and check out some future videos.